Okay, well today we're running a physical agility test. Uh, it's one of the pre-tests to getting hired here with the city. Uh, pretty much what this is about, it's an individual event where we're trying to really see somebody's physical conditioning. Obviously the job of being a fireman is that very demanding and so we take a lot of pride of it, especially here in the valley in Calexico where the weather gets up into well into the hundreds, 110, 120 degrees. Um, with the short staffing that we have, not like bigger city departments, we expect more from our guys. So we're going to push them, we're going to motivate them, and that's what this whole course is designed for. Um, so we're going to check their self-motivation, their conditioning, but we'll be alongside them the whole way, trying to inspire them to keep that tradition of brotherhood alive. Uh, we don't have a set time. Uh, the way the timing does work, though, is that we use that when we start using to kind of decipher who we're going to pick up. Best times obviously rank you higher, and the way the whole process goes is through that, through rank system. You know, if you test first in the written exam, the physical exam, uh, your interviews, the better chance of you getting hired. We have four positions open for this go round, and we have 13 uh, candidates going through today. Hopefully everybody gets through it and we can carry 13 on to the interviews and then we'll choose from there the best four. So uh, how would you describe that? You trained before for this exact kind of stuff? Oh uh, yeah, I've done things similar to this. It's a good workout. It's over pretty quickly. Uh, uh, been a lifelong dream to become a FD? Uh, yeah, yes and no. Uh, didn't really follow this route for the first part of my life, but it's something that was always in the back of my head. So I'm glad I've got a chance to try to do this while well, I still can. Yeah. Absolutely. Uh, hopefully I'm looking like a strong candidate to them. All I can do is lay it out there and give 100% 100 and hope for the best. My family's from Calexico. I live in El Centro right now, so I'm pretty familiar with, with what's around the corner for the summer.